so today we're going to go through a random scenario. Um, I'm going to put myself in the shoes of Western Union, and I'm trying to market my Western Union iOS app to people who are in the market, to, you know, who are using their, their phones to buy things online, sell thing, uh, send money to friends and family via wire transfer, uh, you know, buy things with merchants online, and they're all using these things from their phone, and they have them embrace the Western Union iOS app and services. So, first things first, uh, I want to target people who have a bank account because you need a bank account to do any of these things. So, I'm going to type in financial products, and bank account is yes. So, people who've answered affirmatively to the question, do you have a bank account, is the first targeting parameter we're going to throw in. Next, I'm going to type in a mobile payment services. And because I'm looking for something similar to a Western Union, I'm going to type in PayPal, as that is something that allows you to send and receive money from friends and family. And last but not least, because I am pushing an iPhone app, I want to target people who are using their iPhones I feel comfortable using our iPhones to send and receive money. So I'm going to type in Apple Pay as my last targeting parameter. Last but not least, I'm going to select some channels. Let's say I want to reach, uh, I want to see Keisha's channel. I want to see, I want to see Britt's channel. And last but not least, I want to see now this is living. So I've selected three channels, and luckily all of them have audiences that are 100% do have a big account. Now mobile payment services, we will use PayPal. We're seeing that 26%, 26.9% of Keisha's channel uh, has used PayPal. 14% of Brit Space's channel has used PayPal, and 20% of uh, Now This Is Living's channel has used PayPal. We're going to throw in this third data point. We're saying that 7.10% of Keisha's channel uh, are actually uh, Apple Pay users, 7.3% of Brit's channel are Apple Pay users, and 5% of Now This Is Living are Apple Pay users. So if I'm looking for people who are in best suited for this type of integration, um, I'm going through these channels, finding the audiences um, that they actually cater to and how much of their audiences is it, in, it reflects my target audience, and optimizing my campaigns by, by selecting the best fit channels suited for this campaign. From my perspective, Keisha is a clear winner between the three of these people, um, just based on the data points that we're showing here. Overall, if you were to go with all three of them, you'd be to in total, you would reach 840,000 people, but 152 of them are your exact target audience. People who have a bank account, have used PayPal, and have used Apple Pay. These are and statements, not or statements. If they were or statements, you get a lot more, uh, a lot more target viewership. But we're trying to zone in and harness and really hyper target this audience. So you're seeing and statements, and this is how much of the total audience is in your target demographic overall. This is just some of the, the, the things we can do with 11. What we can also do is add a, another targeting question to, this, to the survey. So one of the questions we, may, we might ask might be, have you used any of these payment services or, or money sending and receiving services such as Zelle? Uh, Cash App or uh, Venmo, things that are more in line with Western Union's core business line of business, so we can really get a grasp on where they stand in the market versus their competitors, and really zone in on, the, on that target audience to convince them that Apple, that a uh, Western Union is better than Zelle, or Western Union is better than Venmo, or Western Union is better than Insert Wire Transfer app here. Uh, yeah, it's been fun. Lots of different exercises you can do. Throw a scenario at us, and we'll get right back to you with a with a demo. Thanks for watching.